this is a call out to all of you yoga haters. Those of you who think, oh, I really don't like yoga. Don't make me do yoga. Yoga is not my thing. I absolutely hate it. I'm here to say there was a time when I first started doing yoga, when I was that. I was a yoga hater. I did not like it because almost everything hurt. I was doing it not because I loved it, not because I felt sexy or, <laughs> or coordinated, or like I was worthy of ever being on the cover of Yoga Journal, but instead I was doing it because I knew somewhere way off in the distance there would be benefits to the practice. And now some 30 years later, I'm here to attest it's the truth. I am so grateful that I have been an avid practicer, practitioner for all these years. So what I wanna remind you is that there is a light at the end of the tunnel. And the reality is the longer that we go without focusing on our own health, our own vitality, our own strength, endurance, flexibility, agility, fitness in general, the harder it is to recover. So now is the time for you to take just a tiny little bit of time, perhaps even 10 minutes a day, and focus your attention on your health and well-being. So if you are so called, there is a 10 minute yoga practice that is all yours. And all you have to do is click on the link and it will take you there and you can find the practice. All right, it might be like 11 minutes and 35 seconds, but it's a perfect practice for yoga haters or for anybody who's fallen off the wagon or fallen away from their own health and vitality and wellness because yoga is one of those things that for me is an ultimate panacea. It's the thing that gives us so much opportunity for vitality and clear vision and putting a cog in the wheel between uh, the stimulus and the response in our lives. It's a thing that we can call upon. It becomes a magic carpet. It becomes a therapist's mat. It becomes or a therapist's chair. It becomes that nap time mat that you had in kindergarten. It becomes all of those things, a place where you can rest and recover and uh, reestablish your foundation and your balance and become resilient and grounded and peaceful and clear. It enhances your relationships, your digestion. Yes, you poop better. I'm here to say all of it, <laughs> all of it, all of it comes in and through the practice of yoga. And it doesn't take very much, just a few minutes a day. So download the practice. Don't trust me. Don't believe a word I say. Try it on for yourself. And I'm here to say, I have a hunch. You're going to feel like I do. Big love to you. Ciao for now.